Hey, this is Mike at the Edit Doctor on Twitter. Um, interesting. Um, here is the uh, pre-release version of Adobe Premiere 6, which I've been working on for a few weeks. As of today, I actually got the driver for a DeckLink card. And a question came out. Michael Garber from Fifth Wall Entertainment asked me, when we used to output 2398 material from a timeline, you could use a Kona or a DeckLink to add the pull-down to the 2398 material on the fly as it's outputting um, like 1080i onto a tape. I actually cannot seem to find a way to do that through settings. And what I've discovered is that because re uh, Premiere works in such a real-time sort of way, you can take 2398 material and put it in a 2997 timeline and hit play. And in Final Cut Pro, it used to always be that the fifth frame in that cadence series was just always a hard fifth frame, no interlacing. And you would have to purchase Graham Natris's pull down to interlace it and actually add the proper cadence and interlacing back in it to get the pull down added to it. And I'm noticing here in Premiere that if I do add this clip here, it is this clip which metadata shows it's 23976 loosely it's 2398 and the timeline here as I'll show you the settings the timeline is a 2997 timeline adding this in uh, it does ask me if I want to change the sequence to what the clip is and I chose no so it's here in the timeline as we'll go through here here's the A frame the B frame and then the C B combination, you can actually see that there's interlacing there. If you could see it on my broadcast monitor, then you would actually really be able to see that the interlacing is actually correct. This is the C and D combination interlacing frame. And then here's the D. A, B, B, C, C, D, D. So it's getting the uh, pull down pattern right, and I'm actually just asking to view it up here as both fields. You can actually choose a single field resolution, but on this I'm actually choosing both for this particular case to demonstrate the point. So in order to add the pull down in Premiere 6 so far, all I seem to be able to do is add it into a timeline that's 2997 and then it creates the proper pull down. Is there a way to output 2398 material with pull down that doesn't require the software to do it? It would be done on the fly through the hardware. So if anybody knows please hit me up on Twitter at theeditdoctor.com. I'm very curious to know. Thanks.